you guys today with the video. Um, today is a hair review. So you guys know that I've been rocking the um, Ace Virgin hair, the King. It's all to me. It's like a kinky curl because the curls are so tight. But um, the actual hair, it's called um, deep curl. So, but to me, like I said, it's like a kinky curl because it's just so tight. Like the curls are so tight. So. Um, yeah, let's get right into it. So, obviously I am not wearing the hair. And you know what, that's another thing. I really don't know if you guys would like me to start doing the reviews with me actually um, wearing the hair when I get my final review. But to me personally, when I see um, hair review videos, I don't like to see the person wearing the hair because I'd like to see them with it off so that way you're able to kind of get a a real good look at the hair up close you know see um, if it naps if what the hair looks like without it being washed right away and that's another thing too I like to do my hair reviews without washing the hair when I do the final review so I want you guys to see what the product is like without it being washed as far as um, co-washed I just feel like it's not like you guys want to be able to see how the hair holds up after a week what it's going to look like after a week after two weeks um, so again, I'm just going to go over some housekeeping that with virgin hair, I always wash the hair, co-wash the hair at least one time a week. And I do use organics, coconut milk, um, shampoo, um, conditioner, and oh, I got, have both, shampoo and the conditioner. And um, you can pick those up at your local beauty supply store, um, at Rite Aid, CVS, Walmart, all those places have them. And they are kind of pricey. Um, I, I don't know if I said this, that if I've said that before, but they are a little bit pricey. They're about eight to nine dollars a bottle. But the good thing is that if you coupon, they always have coupons like um, buy one, get one 50 percent off and you get like some extra care bucks back, things like that. So definitely check that out. I love that shampoo, y'all. So let's get right into the hair. So this is the hair that I've been rocking. Um, <clears throat> You guys can see it looks definitely like a kinky curl. Okay, this hair has not been washed. Um, this is what me wearing the hair the last week and then I just decided to go ahead and do this final review of the hair so you guys can see what it looks like without it being washed. Okay. And I'll probably post some pictures too throughout the video of just me wearing this hair. Um, because I don't think, I think I've probably done like two videos with me actually rocking this hair. But I have been wearing this hair for about three and a half weeks. And obviously you guys see that it is a wig. Um, so just getting into the hair. The luster is amazing, you guys. Like, I am natural. And with in order for me to um, basically blend my natural hair with curly textured like this, I have to use the little perm rods and get the front of my hair, I just leave a little bit of the front of my hair out and I take literally small tiny sections and curl it so that way in the morning time when I take it out it's like BAM like this type of curl and so it blends amazing you guys and my hair like I said is natural and the luster with this hair and my own hair oh, amazing so I that's one plus for the hair okay I love that um the next thing is that this hair is very, very, very low maintenance, you guys. Like, oh my gosh. Um, when I say low maintenance, I, I'm not saying that you have to... What is that? Hmm. Um, when I say low maintenance, I am not saying that you have to have your little... When I think of curly hair, I'm always thinking about you have to have your spray bottle with you at all times because the curls aren't going to look juicy and, um, you know, you have to have your spray bottle mixed with um, your leave-in conditioner and yada yada yada. No, not with this hair, y'all. I swear, I never walked around with a little spray bottle ever. Um, if I did my hair in the morning time with just you know, my spray bottle mixed with conditioner, that was it, you guys. Like, no touch-ups throughout the day. And that's one thing that I loved about this hair. So that is definitely a plus, y'all, because you know, ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody have time for having to always take out your spray bottle, leave it in your purse, your car, your desk, and go into the bathroom. I got to freshen up my curls. No, no one has time for that. So I am... That's, uh, I really love that it was just so low maintenance, y'all. And trust me, I got a lot of compliments with this hair. Like, oh my gosh, you make it look so natural. Um, 
is that a wig is that sewing like no one really know no one ever really knows if i'm wearing a wig honestly unless i tell them or unless you know you watch my youtube videos obviously um but like i said i always love my wig so um ain't no shame in that anyways um so yeah so it's very very low maintenance um this hair was super long. If you guys remember, I did get um, 16 inch, 18 inch, 20 inch, and 22 inches. Um, I decided not to glow with the closure method because I did do the flip over method here. Okay. Um, again, I did use a hot glue gun to make this wig, and I do actually plan on going through and actually sewing the wig down. I don't know if I'm going to use my sewing machine or just hand do it. Um, because again, I, I really did. I love this hair, y'all. Um, now, the only thing that I did not like about it, or not that I didn't like, it's just you know that it's time for a wash. As you guys can see, this hair is due for a wash right now, okay? Um, if you can see these curls here, they're starting to get a little bit frizzy. And that's when you know that it's definitely time for you to, to wash your hair. Now, again, I did not wash this hair before I did this video because I want you guys to see what the hair actually looks like when it needs to be washed and how it holds up after a week, okay? So this is the hair after a week. After a week, it's about time for that wash, as y'all can see. Um, it's getting definitely, you see those little frizzes. So um, that's one thing, and it's not that I didn't like it. I mean, that happens with all hair, you know? Um, so honestly, that's really not even a, a dislike of the hair. Now, with curly hair, you always have that problem with snags. I never got any snags up here, and I, with curly hair, I try not to run my fingers through the hair a lot because it kind of defeats the purpose. Curly is supposed to be big, luscious, and like, boom, you know? So I never really want to continue to run my fingers or a comb through the hair. But sometimes, you know, you're just planning your hair a lot, and you know, it's just a habit sometimes. Um, so what I did notice is that in the back, actually this back portion here um a couple of the curls started to dread let me see if I can show y'all and you know who knows um usually y'all see that and, and it's starting to just, it's just like in the back look right there you see that was just in the back when I wash it it bounces right back camera cut off but like I was saying when I wash it it does bounce right back but <clears throat> um, I really really have to maneuver this in the back like I have to put extra conditioner and make sure I really really work it out now that is a little a downfall because I've had curly hair before where um, it did not dread in the back um, and I know with longer lengths it is a bit difficult because um, Long lace and in the back of your head, it's got a little bit difficult because, you know, this part is constantly rubbing against your clothes and all of that. Um, but I would say that is um, a dislike that I did, that I really didn't like about the hair. Even though it does bounce back, I just didn't like that I had to really maneuver that part really, really well um, in order for it to loosen up and so the hair wouldn't stick together. Um, but, let's see. Shedding, um, the hair, it sheds but minimal shedding like all hair let me show I just put my fingers through and I got I think this is oh this is two pieces actually I mean, honestly that's not really a downfall on my end because um, I really don't mind if a hair sheds now I started minding if a hair sheds if it's excessive shedding hair all hair sheds um, I don't care what anyone says all hair sheds even your own hair sheds so if it's minimal shedding I can definitely deal with that I'm talking about you know a couple of strands here and there when you decide to run your fingers through that's totally fine with me but if it's excessive like that's just a no-no but I can say that this hair with minimal shedding which is something that I did like um, because I've had hair before that's just shed like crazy um, and it's just not cool like you're sitting here like brushing your hair thinking you're all cute and all of a sudden it's like all this hair like, you know like in your seat <laughs> so um so yeah uh oh sorry y'all um, <clears throat> what else? I did use all the time for the frizziness of the hair. Um, well, not really the frizziness, but to main, to, 
So that the hair wouldn't frizz. There you go. Um, I used argan oil and I just took a little dab um, every morning after I did my routine of the water with your um, leave-in conditioner, whatever of your choice. Spray it on and I'll get a little bit of the argan oil and get it and just run my fingers through or my hands through the hair. That way that helped tame um, the frizziness, especially where I live because it's been like super cold and super windy and you know with the wind blowing and the hair's just going crazy so you know it's tend to frizz um, if it's super windy so um, you know that's just to prevent it from frizzing I just use the argan oil and I do that for all my hair honestly y'all um, what else what else what else as far as when the hair got here, um, it was actually very fast. It came within three business days all the way from China, y'all. So that's like a plus. Um, the lady who I was corresponding with, it's Susan, and she is amazing. She answered all questions. Um, when she, when I had emailed her about, um, well, you know, is there any specific hair that you would like me to do or am I able to pick it, you know, myself? And she's like, oh, you know, go ahead and you can pick whatever and just let me know. Now, a cool thing is, is that I am teaming up. I am going to team up with experiencing company. the hair that I've already purchased more hair and I'm actually trying their body waved hair um, because I told her, like, I really love reviewing this hair. Like, you know, I'm going to go ahead and just purchase some for myself. Um, and so then we teamed up actually with the, I teamed up with the company to host a, a, a hair giveaway for you guys. Now, um, right now I am at 495 subscribers and once I hit 500 subscribers, so I just need five more subscribers, you guys, then we will um, launch a hair giveaway for me reaching 500 subscribers and for you guys to try out this hair yourself, okay? Um, I hope you guys really enjoy it, how I enjoyed it. As long as you take care of your hair, you do all of the maintenance that you need to that you will be fine that's with any hair um even synthetic hair like honestly you have to take care of your hair so with that being said um i need five more subscribers you guys i think right now i am at 495 and let's get me to that 500 mark so that we can start this giveaway for you guys and i'm so excited because i want one of you lucky subbies to win hair now the hair would be of your choice you are um You'll be able to um, basically email me what you'll look on the site, see what type of hair you want, either the deep curly, water wave, body wave, straight, um, and all of that. And then that's where we would go from there. So um, <clears throat> overall, I love this hair, y'all. And I hope I've already put pictures throughout the video for you guys, just so you guys can see how magnificent I was rocking this hair, y'all. I got so many compliments. I was kind of feeling myself when I was getting compliments. But um yeah, I believe that is it. If I forgot anything or you guys have any questions about the hair, please let me know. I will leave all of the link to the hair and everything in the description box below. And if you have any comments or anything, please feel free to leave those down in the comment section. And don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe, y'all. Five more subscribers to reach 500 so I can do the giveaway. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love each and every one of you guys. And bye-bye.